welcome back everyone so today i will be showing you that how to permanently change any game or application priority to always high on windows 10 and windows 11. now usually what happens if you want to change the game or application priority you go to the task manager and then you have to look for that application or game for which you want to change the priority now this can be any kind of game like valorant or any other software or application now here for example let's say if i want to change the priority for my this application that is vendor share filmora a video editing software then i have to make a right click on it go to details again i have to look for the wonder share filmora.exe file i have to make a right click on it or up to set priority and i can change it from normal to high or real time so if i go ahead and change it to high and then click on change priority this application will be working in the high priority now but the problem is as soon as i restart my application or game or even my computer the priority will be automatically go back to the normal priority let me show you if i go ahead and close the application now and reopen it and again if i go back to the task manager and look for wondershareflamora.exe and right click on it and if i hover up to set priority so you can see now that it came back to normal from high okay so this is exactly the problem is and if you want that any game or application should always run to high priority even if you restart the game application or the computer it should be always running in the high priority so there is a simple registry tweak that you have to apply so for that what you have to do close everything click on your windows search type registry then from the suggestion you have to click on registry editor click on yes now here from the left hand menu option you have to click on hk local machine then you have to look for software double click on it in the software you have to look for microsoft double click on microsoft and in the microsoft you have to look for windows nt so come to the w section and look for windows nt once you get it again double click on it then double click on current version and in the current version you have to look for image file execution policy so you can come to the i section and you will find image file execution option okay so once you come up here you need to make a right click on it then you have to hover up on new and then you have to click on key now you have to rename this key with the game or application name for which you want to change the game priority order okay so you can again bring up the same software and then i will bring up the task manager and in the details only you have to look for that game or application and you have to look for a file by the name dot exe because we need to get the full name of that particular game or application so here you can make a right click on it then click on properties and from here you can copy the full name of that game or application copy it now go back to the registry editor rename the key right click on it choose rename paste the same name that you copied and once the key has been created again you have to make a right click on it hover up to new click on key and this key you have to rename it as p e r f options where p will be in the capital in perf and o will be capital in options now once you have created click on perf options now on the right hand side on the blank space make a right click hover up to new choose dual 32 bit value then you have to rename it as cpu priority class now here c will be capital p will be capital and class c will be capital the ones you have created again make a double click on it and you have to change the value data from 0 to 3 then you have to click on ok and now you're all done now if i close the registry editor and again if i go back to the task manager and again if i look for the same application i right click on it click on go to details again right click on wondershafilmora.exe click on set priority now if i change it to high and i click on change priority so now let's go back and let me just close the wondershare filmora again so that i can show you that the priority will not be changed so let me close it and now if i again bring it up okay so it's up so i will go back to the task manager again and again if i look for the wondershare filmora right click on it 
hover up to set priority so you can see the priority is still being set to high so it will never go back to normal even if you restart your computer same if you want to change to real time then you can change to real time and whichever you change to it will never be changed even you restart your game application or computer so that's all guys for today hopefully you found this video helpful and if yes do not forget to like and subscribe and i see you in the next video bye bye